Good morning everybody. Today I'm down here at the 76 strip by the Branson Ferris wheel as you can see. I'm gonna walk up and down a little bit of the strip, not too much, but we're just gonna see if we can see some of the Christmas decorations in front of some of the businesses and Christmas trees. And just see what we can see Christmas-wise. If you would like this video, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. And with that, let's check out some Christmas stuff. I'm at the Branson Ferris wheel right here. And it is huge, and they got some Christmas stuff wrapped around these light poles. It's closed right now, so. But I'm just walking up and down and seeing some of the Christmas decorations that are around, so. They got some Christmas trees up here. And there's it not going yet, but. It's pretty big though. But they definitely got some Christmas stuff decorating the Ferris wheel. Here's the big Christmas tree out by the Ferris wheel. When they first put this up, they do have a tree lighting. But unfortunately, I missed it. I believe it was during when we were moving, but yeah, a pretty big Christmas tree right here. Got some lights on it, you can kind of see it, even though it's day, it is a cloudy day, overcast day. But yeah, big Christmas tree right here, right by the Branson Ferris wheel. Pretty cool to see, even just driving up and down the strip here, most businesses have some kind of Christmas decoration out and about for Christmas time. We're gonna walk across Ripley's, believe it or not, the outside, and they got Christmas stuff on the outside. And they got a Christmas tree over there by the military, old military vehicles over there. So I just gotta head across the street. Here's the little better view of the Christmas tree in this little area of old military vehicles. It's pretty cool. And there's a giant bald eagle sculpture over there. But I'm gonna walk through here, check out some of these vehicles. M5 high speed tractor. Class 110 crash truck. And they do have little signs about some of the vehicles here that are over here and gives you some information on them. And this is right next to the Ripley's Believe It or Not and it doesn't cost any money to come through here and check this out. M561 Gamma Goat. I mean, these are all old, old, old military vehicles. There's a leaf blower over there, probably picking it up. They're taking care of the leaves at the Lost Treasure Gulf over there. M3 Half Track, M59 APC. I'm just kind of scrolling, scrolling through here. Nothing slow. I know that leaf blower is probably causing a lot of noise, but just want to give you guys a little look here at these military vehicles water buffalo. I couldn't imagine driving these old things. A 
little sign of about a few of them. Dodge Ambulance. Here's a M29 Weasel. Imagine driving this thing. Duckling. Duckling trailer. Pretty cool little section there here. An otter, M76 otter. Some old military vehicles and a giant bald eagle here and this is recycled metal bald eagle it weighs over 2,000 pounds and is made entirely from recycled scrap metal pieces from old cars So pretty cool little area over here. I do like how they put up a pretty good sized Christmas tree. Right here in this little area, pretty cool. And right next to the military area here is the Lost Treasure Gulf. Which probably because it's getting colder, none of the waterfalls or water features are going right now. but probably still a cool mini golf course. Haven't tried it yet. One of these times I need to get down here, but. The airplane crashed. There's usually water flowing underneath that. Looks pretty cool. But it looks like a pretty cool themed mini golf course. And they got a train track there too. A little train that goes around the track. It's pretty cool. They do have some Christmas decorations here on top of the Ripley's Believe It or Not. And down below by the giant Hulk statue. Don't mind the loud truck. Lots of cars down here on the 76 strip this morning. So yeah, got some Christmas stuff on Ripley's Believe It or Not. I almost thought I was walking in the road here. This sidewalk here is actually asphalt instead of concrete. But there's a curb there, so I know it's not for cars. But yeah, it's asphalt instead of concrete. Haven't seen too much of that. Gonna walk down here to see what kind of Christmas decoration is in front of the Titanic Museum down here. They got a huge red Christmas tree out front of here in the Titanic. This one might be my favorite one. This one's cool. Oh, it's got a spinning star at the top it's spinning and they got some light up stars over there oh they still got the water going here at the titanic oh they got stars all over the place got some reindeer lights down there some lights around the entrance i'm not sure if those lights will i don't even know if the camera's picking it up there's some lights around the top of the titanic but they still got the water going. Makes it look like it's cruising through the... Cruising through the water it makes it look like. Pretty cool. Can 
Art Museum. Been there once, a long time ago, when we first moved here a couple of years ago. Pretty cool. Huh? It's a little windy today. A little breezy right now. It's a cool, cool looking archway here. Branson, Missouri. Center point of the entertainment. And it's got a compass down here. North, west, east, and south. Pretty cool archway here. I don't know if I ever saw that. Right next to Paschetti's. Beyond the lens, it's got a fly ride in there. Have not been here yet, but it's got a pretty cool building. And right across the way is Shoot to the Stars Mini Golf. And then we got the Hollywood Wax Museum right across the way with a giant gorilla. Pretty cool. Not much Christmas down this direction, so I'm going to head back the other way. Well, I walked down to the Hollywood Wax Museum and back, and most of the Christmas stuff in this area is all right here by the Branson Ferris wheel. And Ripley's, believe it or not, across the way has some, so I'm going to drive down a little bit further. There might be some stuff down this other direction. But nothing too crazy. A couple of cool Christmas trees though, right here, and then the red one by the Titanic, so. And there's the Branson Ferris wheel. Ripley's, believe it or not, is right across the street from it. Cool area to check out some old military vehicles. And then the Lost Treasure Golf is right down there too. Yeah, another look at the Ferris wheel. And the Christmas tree. I have to try to come down here one night so we can really see the lights on it down here. We can actually see this Ferris wheel. Can't really see the tree, but we can see the Ferris wheel pretty good from Clay's uh, window of where we live, which is going to be probably right up that direction in those mountains. Right over there. Somewhere over there, because we can see the Ferris wheel from Clay's. Could be that further that way from Clay's window, but it's a pretty cool view if we open his window up. But definitely Christmas trees, Christmas decorations down here by the Ferris wheel. So pretty cool. Glad I stopped down here. With that, that might be our little video, Christmas video down here by the Ferris wheel today. Nothing long, probably a shorter video. Uh, might drive up a little bit, so might have some bonus footage. We'll see what kind of Christmas decorations are up the road a little bit. But if not, if you would like this video, if you're new to the channel, subscribe. Thanks for watching. Check out all our other videos. And if this is it for the debt video, then we'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye. We have a blow up Santa Claus right there with Kansas City Chiefs. Oh, and here comes past Whitewater. Whitewater Christmas tree, even though they're closed. <laughs>